So I had this dream, and it was a dream that I was flying an airplane all by myself. And I don't fly airplanes or anything like that. And it was storming, and I was panicking, and there were all these people on this flight. Turned out it was actually my staff and the patients that we take care of. And, and I was flying them. And why did they trust me? And what was I thinking? I can't fly this plane. And God spoke to me and said, yes, you can. I'm in control. You listen to me. And I will show you how to fly the plane. And whenever I have a rough day, I think about that dream. And I think, this is not my ship. This is not my plane. I really just try to encourage my staff. And I try to be an example to be positive all the time and smile because... Every patient, whenever they come in, no matter how small their procedure is to us, it could be just a little local procedure, but it's huge to them. I always try to encourage my staff to connect with your patient in one way. Just have some kind of connection with them, be it where you live, the people you know, past experiences, you know, whatever it may be, but just some little connection to the patient. Sometimes I need just a few hours of click, click, click decisions. You know, do this, do that, put this patient here, put this patient there, send this person to do that, send this person to lunch, do this, do that. I need that. I love that. Just boom, boom, boom. But all those quick decisions that I've made over the years have made me, I feel like, be more capable to make big decisions that I make now and that impact so many more people and departments. I mean, there are so many employees. There are 120 different people who work in my departments. And there's so many things that I do every day that I don't realize impacts their life. And I don't just mean them as a circulator in the operating room. I mean them as a person. I feel like that my department has improved in the past few years, but I don't feel like that it's been me. I feel like it's been my employees and my managers because they are the ones who are, you know, working all day with the patients and the surgeons and um, as a team.